Alina, I am losing faith in the justice system in America. Yeah. I, I mean, I watch what you've gone through. I watch what some others have gone through. Yeah. And I think many Americans are just in shock. Yeah, they should be. They should be. I'm losing faith. But there are fighters. There is a constitution. We haven't gone so far as to screw that up. We've ignored it. There have been bad decisions by politically motivated people. The problem in our country truly is not the justice system as much as politics. When politics permeate the justice system, we have a problem. That's what's happened. We should not have donors influencing judges, influencing DAs, AGs. The justice system in our country was created in a very near perfect way. Due process, freedom of speech, with limits, with accountability, with laws. When we start disregarding laws for some, but not for one, it's not America. So if we can get back to our system, which exists, is the bedrock of our country. It exists. You should not lose faith. It it still is our country. If we can clean up the mess of politics, I think we'll get into a better spot. You know, it's funny. President Trump had the ability to persecute Hillary Clinton when he was president. He chose not to. That was America. Now it's no one is above the law unless you're a Democrat. How do we fix this? We got to clean the top. The problem is it all permeates from the Department of Justice, the head of the president, the attorney general of this country. That's why this election, I think, is incredibly critical for my industry, um, for the American people to have more faith in America again and to make sure we don't turn into a third world country where we attack our political opponents or attack their lawyers and scare them so that they don't represent people. Mm -hmm. What a world are we in? I mean, that's that's some low level stuff. That's not American. That's that's third world stuff. Feels a little like Baghdad. It's a lot like Baghdad. 